world for commerce purposes. Well, that's the point. That's it. It's fantastic networking. Yes. One of the things I'd like to mention is one of the things that came out of the conference last year mm. was that the foreign delegates realized that the truth of the matter is yes. that on the African continent, Nigeria yeah. has the largest yeah, number of qualified and internationally acclaimed arbitrators. Yeah. But people didn't know until they got to the conference mm. and started meeting Nigerians in all fields mm. who are arbitrators. And so that itself is a way of marketing the country, the country. as open for investment. Mm -hmm. So ready for business. Ready Nigeria for business. Nigeria is ready for right. business. Ready for business. Right. Okay. Is this conference free? Sorry? Is it free? Sorry? <laughs> <laughs> she didn't hear I did that deliberately. It is not free. Um, Bumi is the Secretary General. She'll tell you what the things <laughs> are. You can register the event tomorrow. Yes. It, is, it doesn't break the bank. In terms of what you get, for the opportunity to attend. And the venue being used. What's, okay, the, late, what's the venue? What's the late? Uh, it's a hotel and suites. Okay. And uh, we start the program tomorrow. And we start with the launch of the expedited rules. Like you mentioned, the expedited rules are a new initiative into the ICC rules. The 2017 version will be out. We'll be having the uh, president of the ICC court who will be coming into the country. And uh, we are already receiving mm -hmm. our delegates. Uh, from everything. all over the world. And you say anybody can attend this conference? Anybody, anybody can attend this conference. Pre-registration? Pre-registration is available on www.iccng.org. Okay. And registration, and registration on site is also available. For the value, it will varies it, from members. Will it cost members. you more if I register on site? Yes, it will. So you better hurry up and register Pre, I mean, pre-register. Pre yeah. mm, yes. So you best register today. It cost you more if you go there tomorrow and try to register. And it goes from tomorrow, that's being Sunday, till the 16th. Yes, okay, so let's leave the conference aside. Yes. Let's talk about arbitration okay. briefly. Um, I said earlier about the ease of doing business in Nigeria, mm -hmm. and you said arbitration, um, the conference last year helped those outside investors, potential investors, to know that there are people that can help you. But the question I want to ask is, what are the challenges with arbitration in Nigeria? What are the challenges? Hmm. The challenges to me are one being solved by this conference, which is allowing foreign investors to know that there are capable arbitrators in Nigeria to arbitrate their disputes. And that is being solved. The other challenges are to me minor and are being looked at by government. Visas. Government has done a lot based on what the arbitration community has said. Visas are now available on arrival because these are things that people look at in terms of where you arbitrate your dispute. So visas are being looked at. You can get visas on arrival yes. in Nigeria now. <coughs> you would have documentation showing you are coming for this event. You've got this. Doesn't it depend on which country you're coming from? Um, I think it's nearly it's for all countries all now. Countries. You can, you can mm. get your visas on mm. arrival. But what about mm. the local... Mm investors, the businessmen in do they use arbitration as much as instead of going to court? Because for every little yeah, to thing, court. To go yeah. to it court takes a long time. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. More and more local businessmen Business. use arbitration. However, there are horses for courses because there's arbitration, there's mediation, mediation. which is also That's cheaper, good. faster, faster. Yeah. and for less um, financially Smart. heavy disputes. Spirit. Mediation may be the option. Sure. Arbitration, you tend to find domestic arbitration, confidentiality, speed. And so you do find that a lot of corporates are moving their disputes away from the courts, the courts. and moving them into the arbitration arena. Okay. Not to talk about international Okay, arbitration. since we still have time, I have a problem with... Yes. Miata and company. Alero and she company has a problem, and we have has a problem with Miata and company. <laughs> now, I don't, I don't want to go to court. Yeah. So how do I initiate arbitration so that we can sort out our problems as fast as we can? Well, firstly, it must be a commercial dispute. Yes. So And company okay. and company. But yes. you said domestic arbitration. Yes, domestic the... arbitration is yes. domestic yes. meaning between two Nigerian parties. Okay. Mm. Okay. So first of all, you must have an arbitration clause in a written in agreement. agreement. It has to be written. Yes. It could be by exchange of correspondence, but there must be writing. Okay. So if you don't have a written arbitration agreement, and then you have this dispute, 
you will then so one party will then write to the other and say, look, I suggest that we resolve this dispute by arbitration rather than going to court. Okay. And let's have one arbitrator or three. And the other party writes back and says, yeah, that's good with me. You have an arbitration agreement. And then you proceed to arbitration. And there are so many arbitral bodies within Nigeria yeah. that can either provide right. a venue for your dispute or can actually administer your dispute. Mm -hmm. Or you just go by the arbitration law and it's called ad hoc and you do it yourself. Okay, so we, you have established now that we both have in our agreement, you the know, clause. Mm -hmm. so who do we go to? It depends on what your arbitration clause says. Mm -hmm. If it's an international dispute, we always advise use the ICC. ICC. They have a model clause. No, and we're, we're both local companies. They're both local companies. Yes. You don't you need to go to friend, anybody. Because the arbitration uh -oh. law says, the, the, the arbitration law determines how arbitrators are appointed. If you've agreed on a sole arbitrator, the arbitration law says you both agree on one, and if and you I can't agree on one, then you go to court and ask the court to appoint the arbitrator for you. And once the arbitrator is appointed, he takes over the process. Mm. Simple as that. Okay, let me come to... Okay. You, you, we talked about uh, mediation, arbitration. What's the difference? Okay, mediation in this instance, like she said, it's more of um, you get a, a mediator like to come in between both of you and make both of you to see the reason of having to move forward and uh, find a solution. For instance, if the matter in dispute is just like a million naira worth of contract and uh, you have challenges, you have an opportunity through the mediators to say, okay, I have challenges. This is, this is the challenges I'm going through. This is the process I will go through to ensure that you get your money. Who, I have found who is a mediator? Oh, a mediator is a professional. You can a also professional, be in mediation technique. You must okay. have the training. Okay. We have mediation processes both in ICC and even locally in Nigeria. Okay. What there are quite a lot of mediators in what Nigeria trade? who are okay. very good. A lot of uh, smaller disputes so where do we in go domestic to look disputes. For them? We have the multi doc Lagos You can go to the multi doc The Lagos State Government is multi doc courthouse. And there are also so institutes that are mediation institutes. The ICC yeah. also has a list of mediators. Okay. And the essence is at the end of the day, yes, you, yes. you get yes. a win win situation. Mm -hmm. The mediator advises the parties on their positions and pushes them towards but reaching a agree mutually with. agreed resolution irrespective of legal rights mm. an arbitration looks at the legal, legal. rights of the parties That's mm -hmm. the main difference. okay mm. the <laughs> i'm sorry but let's let it clear i'm having an opportunity here we're having an opportunity to educate nigerians and also get educated as well as regards this matter because you get a lot of court cases that mm. can be taken care of yeah. oh, yes. easily yeah. and i'm also what i want to bring in here is can these also, mediation or arbitration, can it also be applied in the homes? Does no. it have to be commercial? No. It, it doesn't have to be commercial. No. It can be applied in the no. homes. And in fact, using yes. Lagos State, That's which it. is where we are, it is actually a prerequisite that before you actually file a claim in court, you must show you have attempted to settle Settle's your too. dispute. And even then, when it gets into the court, the judge can look at it and say, I think this is a matter that should go to mediation or should go to arbitration. And so you do find that a lot of the lesser, yes, less commercial, less complex disputes mm -hmm. end up staying mm -hmm. in the court and they go outside to be through, through a mediation process. So it's, it's, could be, it's, it's used for everything. Mm. Okay. We will take... Divorce? No, no, because okay. divorce is a legal divorce. status. Okay. What you could mediate okay. in the divorce could be custody of children Should. and maintenance. Okay. But All the right. final dissolution of the marriage must it's be. Okay. okay. We have to go to break now. We'll come back and continue this very interesting conversation. <laughs>